Rise and shine, everybody! Day in the life, week in the life of too hype, week in the life. Oh, I'm groggy. I'm back. I'm ready. We're leaving for the airport in about an hour and a half. Packed a little bit. Time to do stuff. Congrats on your first morning walk, young guy. And to me, that was my first time doing a dog walk this early in the morning. Eh, not a huge fan of the experience, I'm not gonna lie. Before we leave, I need a book to read. I hate being bored on planes. I can't fall asleep on planes, so I just need something to do. So I got this book on Belichick and Brady. I am a Giants fan, but I do like reading about people who are at the best of what they do. I've read tons of autobiographies from all different sports leagues. I love reading them, so hopefully I'll learn some interesting stuff in this book. On the way to the airport, and we're pulling up behind Obi-Wan Kenobi. All right, guys, we're at the airport. Yes, About to have the best chicken sandwiches, right? Yes. Does this win? Shake Shack is the winner. Shake Shack won. Yeah, if you haven't watched that video, go to Jester's channel. I was pointing to Zach. Zach, you getting a chicken sandwich? I'm already getting chicken. Look at me. Oh, are you getting a chicken sandwich? Oh, yeah. I've never tried Chick-fil-A's. Or, sorry. Shake oh, Shack. my God. He's just Shake saying Shake he Shack. ruined it. This thing on. Hey, I'm on the vlog. Started a bit late. I'm in the plane right now on the way to New Orleans with the squad. We haven't traveled as a group in a long time. Can we got the man, Kenny in the building. Yo, what up? Started a vlog, day one. Chilling on the plane too. with Mop. You should probably start the vlog. Nah, I'm gonna start when we get there. I, I, you know, You're gonna skip the plane ride? Everyone's vlogging the plane ride. But anyway, we are headed to New Orleans. New uh, Orleans? I we were going to Texas. Nolens? Knowledge. Are we going to Texas? I don't know, we're going somewhere. I have no idea. But um, yeah, we'll check back when we land. I woke up two mornings ago. This guy showed up right here and he said, Hi, Jesse. I'm Temple. I live here now. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, Jesse. When we were filming your video yesterday, I, that thing was really distracting. It's distracting? I want to be on your left side so I don't have to see it. You know? Wow. Be nice to Oak Tree. Oak Tree is <laughs> his Oak name? Tree? His name is Okelfer. 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 So let me show you guys my ugly refrigerator. Ain't nothing in there. <laughs> but it basically. I eat grapes like all the time, y'all. Like I love grapes, man. For some reason, like grapes been like my new addiction. Like I've been addicted to grapes. I have to eat like, if not a whole bag, half a bag a day, which is random grapes. I don't know what it is, but grapes. I just, I just love grapes. Weather check. Oh, it's hot. I miss California. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see the weather right now. No, just kidding. I know you can't see it. Stupid. All right, we have landed. We're all here. It's hot as shit. Now we just gotta find where the hell the Uber is supposed to pick us up. Dude, I slept like a baby on the plane. I don't know about everybody else. I have yet to find the perfect comfortability. You know, like a neck pillow. My neck's too long for those, so those don't work, but... I, I, it doesn't matter, I can fall asleep, so I'm good. All right, y'all, so I've been having my little cheat meals and everything late at night, right? So the other night I had Malcolm here, we went to KFC, guys, a famous bowl. You gotta know them famous bowls, all right? Them things really are nice, bro, the mashed potatoes. But it doesn't really talk about that, all right? With chicken, yeah, ooh, I'm gonna want it. But yeah, they get with a free cookie. And I'm like, man, you know what? I haven't had a cheap meal or diet, you know, whatever, in a minute. Put in the microwave by accident for too long. What is that? What is that? What is that? Luckily, this is how I like my cookies. <laughs> so guys, um, I'm eating my daily meals. If you guys know, I probably look like cat food right now. I eat this about two or three times a day. That's how I keep my diet up. Uh, today, I supposed to go actually play this trash talker I met the other day in the mall. He's a 15 year old kid who can dunk. And he's like 6'4", so that's amazing. But it's raining outside. I don't know yet. I'm going to keep you guys updated what's going on. I made it out to New Orleans. Uh, I'm in a room right now. We just checked into the hotel. Give you all a little tour of the room. All right, walk in. Got the little bathroom over here. Sink, little shower, not bad. The main room here. Big old king size, you know what I'm saying? You already know. And then the view is like, I'm on a corner. So I got these corner windows. I don't know if y'all can see outside, but we right across from the uh, from the Smoothie King Center. In the Mercedes-Benz Superdome. Pretty fire, man. All right, guys, so I made it to my hotel room, and um, this was this was in it. There's just uh, just sushi laying out for me. I don't know how old that is. Hey, but if you like this video, That's nasty. I'll eat it right now. Giving you a chance right now. Like the video. All right, fuck. I know you peeped the drip. Drip check. Drip check. Drip alert. Drip alert. Hey. All right, guys. 
We out here at this barbecue joint. Forgot to vlog our food. I think we all did. I don't know who in the group. Did you vlog? No, just imagine some, some brisket and some ribs. And the ribs were eating it. fire. You know how fast I am, boys? All right, ready? Stupid. I made it to my hotel room. I feel like everyone's gonna do hotel room reviews, so I'll make mine quick. Toilet, mirror, shower, bed. Lamp. And that concludes the room tour. All right, you guys, we are in the hotel. This is pretty much my first time vlogging properly. I, I need to work on it. You know, in the last 2-8 vlogging video, I didn't do the best job. This week will be different. You will see more of my in the life of me. Hey, man. This is, as long in, as you don't pull a Zach and start vlogging five days into the challenge or the video, you're good. <laughs> I will do better than that. We are showing in the hotel room. I got two queen beds. I thought I'd be getting a king, but now I can have yeah, Jesse hang out. I'm coming over. And it's cool. Because all the guys are drinking and going out, and we are underage, so we are not going to be participating. <laughs> yeah, but we get to watch Peppa we get to watch. Man. No, why do you want to watch that? I love Peppa. Oh. Also, I tried the Shake Shack chicken sandwich. Can confirm it is better than Chick-fil-A. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Guys, I don't think I told you why we're in New Orleans. Basically, tomorrow with SeatGeek, we are filming some videos with some of the Pelicans players. I'm going to do a video with Lonzo. I was going to wear my big baller brand shoes, but after all the drama, I decided I'm going to keep them in the closet. But right now, I'm about to think of some questions to ask them because I want to do a series where I do horse Q&As with NBA players. I've done a, like two or three right so far, but I'm going to try to make it a series and make a banger one with Lonzo tomorrow. So I'm going to come up with some questions right now. Um, Guys, I don't know if you remember, but I showed y'all that there was sushi for me and I didn't order that shit. Now that I'm back from dinner, where, where'd it go? What, they just gave me a dirty room or I, like, what the fuck is good? My shoe's still here. I've been yoinked. Actually, I'm kind of glad they took that shit out. I was gonna probably smell. But yeah, that's pretty much today. Uh, I'm gonna call it a night. I'm pretty tired. Uh, we gotta get up pretty early tomorrow. Doing some baked things with the pelicans. Gonna shoot a video with Lonzo Ball. Yeah. So we're doing something big things with Seat Geek tomorrow. The whole two hype should be fun, and you guys are gonna see that very soon. <laughs> Morning, everybody. It's Saturday. We're in New Orleans. Wow. And about to film a video with Kendrick Williams and all the guys. I think some guys are doing videos with Lonzo, which is pretty cool. Okay, so I was just about to take a shower and I got trolled so hard. Look at all the water on the ground. Let me show you guys what happened. I was going to take a shower like any other day. So I, I reached down and I, I pull it, you know? This thing was faced like this that at me it was faced at me oh 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 it is soaked in here um that's what happened though Shh, you guys can't see that's really wet what's good vlog day two we are still in new orleans we're about to go over to the smoothie king center right over here you guys can actually see it now that it's daytime and there's the uh, mercedes-benz superdome that's where the saints play we're about to head over there right now they got lonzo ball and a couple other players that we're gonna try to make some videos with um then we're gonna do a too high video then we're gonna do some like personal channel videos but tristan's here aj lapre's here um all the guys from too hype cash drove up he's only like a couple hours away so it should be a pretty good day <laughs> I right, we just pulled up to the Pelicans yeah. and Saints facility. Got some vans yeah. came out. What's good, fellas? What's up? Say something yeah. to the vlog. Where we at? Yeah. New Orleans. What y'all doing? Visiting because the owner of our football team is Ted Ginn Jr. So he flew us out here. Nice. It's his birthday. Where y'all? It's for you. It's your birthday. Hey, happy birthday, bro. Thank you. What's your name? Cam. Cam. What you doing here? Uh, we're visiting for the game tomorrow. I gotta work on your shot. I gotta work on my shot? Dude, that's why I'm here. One of the players is gonna help me work on my shot right now. Okay. So he's gonna coach me. I think he's got a lot to say. I think he's gonna say a lot, you know? We're all here in the lobby. Everyone is out here. We are all waiting on cash. We gotta leave the cash? Yeah. That's game over. <laughs> Welcome to Louisiana. I'm going to pick up Matt for y'all, come out to go film. And this is what I did with just about yeah, three times a week in Louisiana, man. Sheesh. Woo. We out here, got my Pelican shirt on. Boys, I look rough right now. You see my eyes. I, it's too early for me. I don't know why. You look like shit, bro. Look, man, I overslept in case you couldn't tell. Yeah, we out here in the Pelicans practice yes, arena. Sir. But anyways, we're just uh, waiting for Alonzo to pull up. Shout out to Seat Geek one time. We lit. All right. Alonzo, practice. 
for it right now. Warming up for the shoot. First shot. Also, I just came back from an ankle sprain. Guess what shoes I sprained them in? KD4s. Different colorway though, so this one should be good. I still got it, Kim! I think for my video, I'm gonna have, it's gonna be titled like, NBA player coaches me. I haven't taken a single shot, and I'm not going to until the video. So that's gonna be like my natural, just disgusting shot. Hopefully the player can help me, we'll see. I'm probably not gonna vlog again until after the shoot, so keep you guys updated then. What's good guys, it's Kenny. I'm taking over Jester's vlog right now. Hey, I just gotta say, you know, big shout out to my boy Jester, flying me out to New Orleans right now with the squad. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to film with Lonzo, so uh, hey, big shout out to him. We have just wrapped the shoot. Kenrich Williams and Lonzo Ball. I did a horse video. It was a little rushed, I'm not gonna lie, so. I also did a horse video. <laughs> I, I don't know, Lonzo was kind of, he's definitely more of a very calm guy. You can tell like, he's the type where he's not like, energetic at all unless he's with his boys. But, should be an interesting video. Okay, we just got back from the practice facility, but yeah, the shoot was really cool I got an awesome video with Kenrick Williams where he basically tried to help fix my jump shot It really isn't fixed, but he, he's guiding me in the, the right direction, you know, what time is it now? 1.32, we got to meet at 5 for the, there's some kind of practice, I forget exactly, but we're gonna meet up at 5 for that Gonna take a fat nap, eat some food, chill out. I'm sure the other guys are doing a good job vlogging what's going on too, so keep you guys updated then. All right, um, I'm not much of an explorer in terms of eating. I just got a burger, but James's actually looks delicious. I kind of regret mine now. That looks so scrumptious. Good. Hey, hey, I just went on a shopping spree. And I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I kind of want to look crazy, okay? I only really go shopping kind of when I go on trips, so I was like, I gotta go, I gotta go crazy crazy. So I got off-white hoodie. It has extremely long laces, which is cool, and then, you know, it's simple on the front, but the back, in my opinion, the cool part. And then I went to Foot Locker, I saw they had the Patrick Nike, and they had the Squidward, so I got the two Nike shirts. This literally just came out today, this human race, human made shoe, which I think is really cool. And then I got some swim trunks, and... This Zion jersey, and I'm gonna see him tonight. And it looks like there's already people lining up to get into the practice. Doesn't start for another like hour and a half. Up to the Smoothie King Center. It's like we're gonna go to uh, Pelicans practice. Go out here. Ready to go courtside, boys? Ready. Yes, sir. Look at Cassius' yes, muscles. Sir. Look at those muscles. Oh. Oh. I'm bringing the muscle out here in Louisiana, yeah. man. It's my state. He got my so city. mad earlier. He I got his pride sleeves out here, man. Yeah, you just ripped your sleeves off. Yeah, look at him. He got so mad. He just ripped them things off. He said it's too hot. <laughs> and we are coming out of the tunnels onto the floor. Woo! I haven't seen this stadium this pack before. We big litty. Woo! Oh, Cash Nasty. LSK, it's Lee. About to start the man, the myth, Zion. We are at the practice right now. We're sitting courtside hey, at the practice. Hats. They gave us some hats. Bro, I forgot JJ Redick was on the team. I'm a JJ Redick fan. JJ's cool. I liked him when he was on the Clippers. I liked him on the Sixers too. I liked him when he was in college. Yeah, he was a beast in college. He was shooting way back here, bro. JJ Redick, I love you. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> I, I'm waving to all my friends right now. She's not gonna wave back at us, bro. Alright, how much you want, Ben? At least one will wave back. You didn't like it? Uh, you, you like Zion singing? Did you like Zion singing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, first courtside experience. It's been like maybe 15 minutes or so. I don't know how you can go back to normal seats after sitting courtside. Hello? Hello! Is this a vlog? Courtside is ridiculous. Oh yeah, courtside. I, you never want to sit anywhere else. After yeah, you I'm sad. <laughs> Wave, wave, wave. <laughs> He's waving. <laughs> he waved to you, bro. Yes. Oh, Lonzo got a bigger standing ovation than Zion. That was hard. JJ! Motherfucker. Oh, shit. What happened there, buddy? Cash. Got that on it. Oh, no. ah! 
Alright you guys, I'm super awkward in public again, I'm just saying it. I am going to be trying gumbo, black and red fit. This is my cousin by the way. Chef, I'm Jacqueline. She's really cool. Do you have anything to say? Uh, so, I go to school in New Orleans and I'm taking Tyler to this restaurant called Giacomo's, which is in Uptown New Orleans and has amazing Cajun and Creole food, so we're having him try. I'm gonna try rabbit for the first time and gumbo for the first time. I think I'll like all that. Alright you guys, we got the gumbo. So this is my first time. You just eat it from the... Yeah, yeah, go ahead, eat it from the thing. That's it. That's really good. That's it? That's so good. Yeah. That's the stuff. Alright you guys, we just ate all the food and we're in some serious pain. I did not record all the food we ate. I did a bad job with that, I'm sorry. Alright guys, so right here we've got some deer. Blackened deer. Alligator. Alligator. Deer? We're talking about deer. Stupid. Right here is the gator. All right, black and gator. What are these little poppers? Gator poppers. poppers. Gator poppers. And then we got some fried gator over there. Haven't tried any of this, but I'm gonna give it a shot. This is good. Black and. Let's try it with the sauce. Oh, time for the fried. I don't know. I like the fries. Do you? Want to go black and eat it? Yeah. <laughs> Good one. Dan, 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 all, Dan always got to get a highlight. He, he was he was busy for it. He was busy for that highlight of the vlog. I, I'll, give, I'll give you that, Dan. We'll go put that in there. We're wrapping it up. Uh, fly out pretty early. I fly out early. I don't know what time. We all have different flights. Where are you going, Chris? Don't worry about that, man. No, I'm going to Kansas. Meet up with a hometown friend. The rest of the guys are going home, I think. I don't know, but you guys will see in the vlog. So it's Sunday, it's like eight o'clock in the morning. And as you guys know, I'm in New Orleans and I'm literally like right across from the Mercedes-Benz Superdome. The Saints are playing at noon today. And these guys are like throwing a party right outside the stadium, like the entrance or whatever. Like I, you guys might even be able to hear it. I'm about to show you, but I'm trying to sleep in because our flight isn't until later today. And I just wanted to chill, but these guys are like it's so loud bro i'm about to show y'all like bro it's so early there's barely anybody here but it's so loud but anyway i'm about to go eat some breakfast don't make fun of my hair this is what it looked like when i wake up before i take a shower so <laughs> i'm about to go eat some breakfast pack my stuff up and then head to the airport all right guys i'm all packed little update on the saints game i think they're starting to let people in now but it's packed over there any saints fans watching the video good luck man but anyway i'm all packed about to leave this room head to the airport we out good morning beautiful people of new orleans look at all those beautiful faces down there and that is a super awesome building that is a cool building they're all preparing for the saints game and i'm about to leave so i'll see you later new orleans all right you guys leaving new orleans i would say nine out of ten trip awesome time i think i did a pretty good job vlogging i'm happy with myself dude the wi-fi is, is ass <laughs> This shit is trash. All right, guys, we're at the airport. James is freaking out because he's trying to watch his Giants play, but the Wi-Fi is not working. <laughs> Dude, it freeze. It freeze. <laughs> Jesse's uploading a video on the Wi-Fi. Mopey's playing Cub Penguin, so that's probably bugging him. <laughs> Can't even get ESPN scoreboard to load, and it keeps. It's back. It's back. Oh. Did he... Yes. He Wait, scored. I don't know. Is he gonna drop it? What's gonna happen? <laughs> It's frozen, he doesn't know. It froze right when it looked like he caught it, but also like, maybe he dropped it, oh we don't know. Oh my gosh. Kenny's got something to say to the blow. Dude, I might get a Dude, I could beat you one on one easily, bro. Kenny, easily. why are you capping? Yeah, I've cheesecake. heard I've heard you just lost your mojo and like, I've been working on my game. Kenny, you're, you're like what's happened every time we've played one on one? That's when you were like in shape, bro, but I've been watching I'm you. still in shape. Man, I don't know, bro. Thomas told me he beat you like, I think he said he played you like 25 times. He said he beat you like 20 times. I'm not even capping, see? Uh, you, Thomas did say that. He actually did say that. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not lying. Chris, um, if you're watching this, you might have to start looking for a new cameraman because when I get home, can we talk about Danny motherfucking dimes with another touchdown pass? Another, touchdown? another oh, one? Boy, bro. Wait, oh. now you're on the ESPN. <laughs>
do that. Can you even I, watch the game? I He's got to watch the play by play on the worst side. Hey, Danny Dimes scored a touchdown. That's all I know. Bro, what is he doing? Lord drip drop in the building. Be with glasses on. He actually lowers 20 IQ points when he puts them on. Alright boys, we're back Thanks. in LA. Yeah. Pleasure to welcome you. Nine out of ten trip. Nine out of ten trip. It was a pretty good trip. Very happy I went. Glad we got the opportunity. Have fun with Lonzo and Kenrich. Have fun seeing Zion play from floor seats. Yo James! How those Giants do? <laughs> yeah, the Giants got destroyed. James is upset. He probably won't talk to anybody for the rest of the day. He'll just go home and play World of Warcraft for the rest of the night. <laughs> Jesse, how was your flight? The guy sitting next to James was weird as hell. He ruined it. The guy sitting next to James was weird? Did you have a weirdo sitting by you? Bro, he kept touching Jesse. It was so awkward. <laughs> what? He <laughs> tried to touch me, bro. Wait, wasn't Kenny sitting there? What the hell? <laughs> we are back home. Oh, it feels so good to be home, except I'm about to head out. I'm driving to UC Santa Barbara, which is like an hour away from here, to visit my friend Todd for a good reason. So, I don't know when this is going out exactly, but I have made my own card game with Chris. It is called Dare to Play. This is like our mock thing we made to have to make content with until you know obviously we get the official ones but let me explain this game me and Chris made me and Chris have been wanting to make a card game for the longest time we've been talking about it for literally like years we've done so many card game videos you don't really see it on my channel but we've done a ton on the other guys channel and basically dare to play I'm not gonna spend too much time explaining it because it is the vlog of the week and I don't want to just be like here's my card game but it's pretty awesome we have a Kickstarter for it you can check that out it comes with over 400 cards 300 trivia cards the way it works is you get asked a trivia card if you get it wrong, you have to do a dare. So I'll pull one out. Talk in a British accent until your next turn. So if you don't want to do the dare, you can say, hey, I man, I ain't doing that. You're out of the game. If you do do it, you stay in the game. Let's say you get the trivia question right, then you get to keep the trivia card. And first two, seven trivia cards, the amount changes based on the amount of players you have in the game, but wins the game. And there's also group activities like safe cards where it's like, get out of a dare. Bunch of different stuff, but hella fun. But I'm going down to UC Santa Barbara to record Todd and his friends playing the game for our Kickstarter video because we want to have a bunch of different groups of people playing the game for the video and it's not just us, you know, and the two hype guys. I want to have like a bunch of different people playing and we're still play testing it, fine tuning everything. Like we've had a play test where we're like, you know what, we don't really like that dare. Let's switch that with a different one. Yeah, so this is super awesome. I'm really excited. I'm honestly super proud of what me and Chris are able to make. Check out the Kickstarter if you want to support really fun game to play with friends we literally have so much fun playing it and yeah i'm gonna go down there film them let's do it your mouth with water and pretend to be a fountain <laughs> get some water do it <laughs> do your fountain <laughs> to go head to head with, both of you will say, yeah boy. Whoever can say it the longest without taking your breath wins. Yeah boy! <laughs> All right, we just finished up a play testing to Dare to Play. What is everyone's thoughts, real quick? Very fun. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a fun game. 9.5 out of 10, very much enjoyed. 9.5, give it a 9.8. Do, would you say you learned something, like an interesting fact? Yeah, I I mean, that's an interesting one. I did. All right, Todd, you got a black card. You know what that means. Oh, jeez. Get slapped in the face by everyone <laughs> playing. <laughs> Todd, hello. I have to ask. I feel like oh, I'm one of your only male friends. Well, <laughs> appreciate you. Thank you so much for helping me with the game. Everyone, get the Kickstarter. It was interesting to see a different group of people who I haven't seen play it. But yeah, we're gonna make a couple changes to the game. I saw a couple questions that might be taken out, rewarded, kind of things like that. So it's it's been good. Monday morning, back from New Orleans. First thing I'm gonna do is edit 
the video I recorded there. So yeah, about to log on to this computer, record my video, saying hello to the little guy again. And yeah, just about to edit. So not a lot of exciting stuff going on. All right, now it's about almost 10 in the morning. Video is done rendering. Got a little mopey on my other screen. Vegeta has come to visit Cookie. Cook, it's your best friend. All right, done uploading that. And now we are off to Home Depot to buy stuff for my video today. I do a lot more shopping for my videos now that I moved away from 2K. But it's been fun, but more expensive. You're not coming, little guy. Get back inside. Materials acquired. Uh, it's gonna be a little bit before we start filming, so I'm probably gonna go work on my own stuff for a little bit. Yeah. Yo, what's up? Monday morning. So today, me and Jade are gonna go on a little adventure. adventure. Yeah, adventure, Jeez. I guess you could call it. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do, so, um, but last night, when I got back, we went to Trader Joe's and we got some snacks. Now, you guys follow me on Twitter, I tweeted out the other day that Trader Joe's has the best snacks, and uh, I'll show you guys what I got. All right, so we got these JoJo's Halloween cookies. They're kind of like Oreos, but they're pumpkin-shaped, and they got like orange cream in them. Those are amazing. We got the cheese crunchies, because Jade loves those. And we got the potato sticks. She loves those. These are amazing. These are probably the best thing that we got there. Candy corn popcorn. It's basically popcorn with like, kind of like caramel corn, but it's like candy it's corn. It's like you can't get enough anymore. Yeah, they're so amazing. But anyway, we're gonna go on our adventure um, and we will check back later. All right, y'all, so I finally got my hair cut, man. What you guys rate it, man. He did me up nice, a little bit newer, new barber, man, new things, you know. It is what it is, gotta move on, man, you know. I was loyal to my old barber. It is what it is, man. It ain't feel good, but it looks good. Yee. All right, me and Mitchell just got back from the tattoo parlor doing a fun video. I know all of you guys want to see my wiener. I've seen the comments. <laughs> so I'll show you my wiener. Lil Humphrey, he's getting a little bloody. Yeah, he is. Good boy. Yo, we just did a hydro dipping challenge for James's video and we adding- doing the thumbnail. Yeah, you We were adding that. paint to the bucket just for the thumbnail. Jesse looks away and he uh, he spray painted my hand. <laughs> you got this hydro stuff, dip on your wrist. This does not come off. <laughs> Guys, Kenny just destroyed me in basketball. We just had a great hoop, se hoop session. Me and James, man. All right, let's see if I can get it done. We just play for like an hour and a half. <laughs> okay, I'm wrapping up the day. It was actually a pretty eventful day I didn't vlog too much because I was kind of doing like a vlog of the day for my own channel But I am off to bed I'm about to play some overwatch for a little and then catch some sleep. I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace Two I vlog just got pretty crazy. We just called in a, a fire um, We just watched the Joker movie and we were driving home and noticed a freaking fire. Uh, this is crazy. I don't really Such know what to do. Not just a fire, a car inside of a car dealership is on fire. Yeah. So if Maybe one we'll of them pops, car. Maybe we'll get a free car. They're all popping. Let's go get a free car. Maybe let's, you can get some better gas just, mileage. Can we, can we just go home and get past this fire, please? That car is on fire fire. What do we what do we do? What I'm the fuck? I'm pulling right here. We're vloggers. Oh, fuck it. We're YouTubers. Fuck it. We're gonna capture this. This is our vlog. This is for the two eye channel. Oh my god. Yo, Mercedes, you're welcome. Here comes the popo. Dude, the, the other car next to it, the glass in the back was shattered. All right, guys, so I just got home. Uh, I actually went to Kansas uh, visiting a childhood friend of mine. So I didn't vlog that day yesterday or a lot of today just because I've just been busy traveling and stuff. But as soon as I come back, you know, went to the movies to see the Joker. And then as we're leaving, what you just saw is what we just saw. Call 911, called in the fire. Thank God the fire department was like literally right there because if it wasn't, I feel like that whole dealership would have exploded. We probably would have exploded. Hope everything's okay and we're okay. It's like midnight now. I'm gonna vlog a lot more tomorrow. Well, peace. Good morning, it's the next day. I didn't find anything to do yesterday, so we just got food and came back home. Wasn't really much to vlog, but we did go see a movie. We saw Joker. We went to see Joker. How'd you like it? 
I didn't go. Oh yeah, I forgot you didn't go. I, how do you think I went? And I, you literally went. I was listen. There. I, <laughs> listen. Hey, you listen. Were you were I was focused. focused. On the movie. <laughs> I was so focused on the movie. So what do we have planned for today? Today, it's basketball day. Out of the day. park. Well, look at this guy. Oh, coming in. Here comes James oh. with all his equipment. Let's okay. see this. What's he got here? He Name got? the equipment. What do we got? What do we got? Sony A2. Okay. Or A7 II. Sony okay. A7 III. Okay. Bronze 16s. Okay. That's all you need. That's all I need. That's all you need. All right. We got basketballs. We got tripods. We got cameras. We got shoes. We're ready to go. About to head to the park. Make some bangers. Yes, sir. Can I get a dab? All right, guys, we made it to Laser Courts. If you're an OG Jesser fan, you guys recognize these courts. A lot of bangers happen here. How's your uh, your Plasti Dip shoes, man? Dude, you like them? It's coming off quick. Oh, it's coming off already? <laughs> yeah. Dang. Oh, can't show James' feet. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, next day, it's Tuesday. The police is on the scene trying to figure out what happened, I'm sure. Um, maybe we should go out and file a report. I don't know. What should we do? Obviously, they're on it already, you idiot. Oh, guys, how do you think that car caught on fire? Comment down below. What do you think, babe? I think someone said, fuck the rich people of Calabasas and tried to light all the Mercedes It was just on fire. the irony of us watching the Joker and then we see that i don't know might have been on some clown shit. i don't know i'm scared i'm a little shook i'm a little shook oh uh, i'm putting it on my hood i'm sad i'm not really sad i just i should be doing a better job i forgot to vlog more yesterday after we we did the robot video today is tuesday and right now i need to clean up the robot stuff uh, and get some stuff for a video and then we're gonna record basketball videos as well today hey look at my shoes look at my shoes from james's video these came out pretty nice actually god damn what happened here no let me show you guys the aftermath of the robot fighting the illegal robot fighting yeah this was the video they would spin around. you know what i'll just show you a little bit oh shit come on death biscuit there we go and the fight is on the way. In the video, we had stuff so that this wouldn't happen. Oh god, oh god. We've been grinding out the basketball videos. We have to take a break like every 15 minutes because our cameras overheat every time. But yeah, this is one of our breaks. We're just chilling, everyone's tired, it's hot. I'm just finished hooping. Now I think we're all about to head over to Shake Shack. Get that chicken sandwich if you know what I'm saying. Yum yum, got the greatest chicken sandwich. Damn, oh Damn, my god. Yummy. Oh, I'm so jealous. Oh, um, after years, I have finally upgraded laptops. I got a laptop that's like completely different to than the one I have right now. Huh? But I know you want to look at it. <laughs> Humphrey, why are you standing on my laptop? <laughs> Give me a second. It comes in a little box. I got a 13 inch. I wanted a small one that I could easily travel with because my other one is too big to fit in my laptop and it, I could only fit in my suitcase. I mean, it, my other one is too big to fit in any backpack. Damn, look how thin this thing is. Ooh. I like it. The room's all clean. Now I'm just kind of, I'm kind of chilling. I'm actually not going to get the pumpkins before we record basketball videos. So I'm just, I'm just chilling, cruising around on my hoverboard. Ah! <laughs> Fucking hell, I just hit my heel. I ran over my heel. Guys, um, <laughs> we just witnessed a, a car accident. I don't know what's going on. It's pretty bad. Wow, I already hear the police. Police are on That's it quick. quick. Bro, we literally, like, what is going on? Two days in a row. <laughs> We're at the bank, and we just, we, we yeah, literally witnessed. He got fucked up. And he hit her. Dude, last night, I see a car blow up. Today, I'm seeing a car crash. <laughs> bro, I don't like the uh, I don't like this. Even, ever since I, home, ever, <laughs> ever since I saw the Joker, some crazy shit is happening, guys. It's getting bad. All right, so I, um, I got all the pumpkins. Here they are. Ten beautiful pumpkins. I had to buy, like, all they had from Ralph's. I felt kind of bad. They had a few left, but I did buy a lot of them. Yeah, we're gonna be throwing these bitches. We're gonna be lobbing them. Trying to get them to go far. See so you can make him go the farthest, actually. Moving pumpkins up a hill is tiring. Five pumpkins is hard. All right, to my vlog. We just finished the pumpkin throwing video. What would we you guys- saw a bat. Look, a bat, two bats, maybe. What? Nah, they went up. 
Are you trying to record me just in case I fall or something? 100%. Late at night here on uh, Tuesday. My hair looks like trash. And we are here working on these uh, salmon off-whites. That's right, this is made with salmon. You can see the texture, the detail. Stitching sucks, but I'm learning. But these will be cool, especially since stitching you can't really see until you're super close. So yeah, hopefully these turn out good. They're pretty much done. I mean, they're in the hat form right now. Yeah, this is how my Tuesday night's going. All right, you guys, it is Wednesday morning. I'm doing a good job vlogging. Not really. Didn't really update you guys after the pumpkin stuff, but there wasn't much. Today, we were going to the beach and seeing who can stay in the ocean the longest. This is Jesse's video. It's gonna take a long time, probably like five or six hours. And then I got a dinner at five because it is a Jewish holiday. It's the Jewish New Year. Yum Kippur. Think I said that right? I, I'm not the best Jew. All right, y'all. It's about 10.30. We're about to head to the beach for my video. I'm really excited to do this video, Last to Leave the Ocean. I love the Last to Leave videos. It's such a fun series. Yeah, I feel bad, Kenny. I told him we were leaving at 9.30. He got to the beach at 10. It's like 11.20 right now, <laughs> but... Go check out Kenny's kid. <laughs> yeah. First of Ocean to to recording the videos. Yeah, we're about to skirt. Sorry, Kenward. You guys, let me let me show the outfit. I feel like I'm dripping. Oh my god. We got all the blues the on dude today. Dude is wearing two Nike logos on top of each other. It's like stacked on top of each other. I am so sorry, y'all. So sorry that my life is boring. Honestly. If it ain't weight lifted, if it ain't just eating or playing 2K, that's all I'm doing right now, y'all. Like, honestly. I actually just got some bourbon fish and some steak. Uh, me and Ash about to go barbecue and just rewind on time. Because tomorrow I'm leaving out to Cali for about two weeks. Then I come back. So, uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I got Halloween stuff out. This is actually one of my favorite times when I was a uh, manager at Walmart. I always like seeing colorful candy behind there. Don't look so colorful. That Louisiana weather compared to Cali weather is so different, man. I'm telling you, you guys live out there in Cali, bro. Y'all taking that weather right there for granted, man. 80 degrees out here, you be sweating. 80 degrees out there in Cali, you good. You see people with long sleeves out there, bro. The humidity out here is crazy, man. Uh, this is not a good sign at all. Bro, it's ice. <laughs> like ice bath? Like ice bath. Kenny! Sorry for being late. No Kenny, I'm trying to, Bro, Kenny doesn't understand. I'm trying to say, whoever gets first place, Kenny's gonna be right there with them the whole time next to them in the water. Dude, am I winning like 10% of this thousand <laughs> or like what, bro? You told, you didn't even tell me. You just yeah, said I'm recording. Hey, I'm gonna take one for the team. I'm gonna be in the water too. Appreciate that. Uh, so you think you're gonna win? No. Yeah, I just came back from the gas station. Why was this on the floor, man? Huh? Mac. So you're gonna act like I'm not here. This right here. Why was this out of the trash can? Huh? Jesse, what? What are you doing? Get your hand off her. What's her name again? Bro, Kenny made his dream girl and she looks like Slenderman with an ass. Jesse told me to come here at 10. It's currently 12. <laughs> get so, fucked. Uh, you know, I thought I'd get a little creative out here in Cali and uh, make a mermaid. Why is she so long? I like long. Wait, do you have like an emotional attachment to this thing? Yeah. You'd be sad if something like happened to her? I'd be kind of devastated. That's messed up. So I just want to step in the middle of it, bro. No. You know how long it took me to fall? Oh! oh bro. That's messed James up. James has been wanting to do that for so long. Just got done from the beach. For Jesse's video, I'm feeling the sunburn a little bit. I don't know if I actually am. Maybe I just feel it because I had so much salt water in my face for so long. Last to leave the ocean, we just filmed that. We're getting ready to film my video, Breaking Pointless World Records. Now, I do need to get some things for that video, so I'm gonna head over to the grocery market and do that. But look at the shoes. They're really coming together. They don't have soles yet. No soles, but they're really coming together. Oh, where are you going, bro? Mall. Okay, what you copping? Some uh, soles for my shoes and some thread. Have you been showing them the shoes? A little bit. Okay. Well, last time they said I showed too much. So <laughs> I was a little conscious about it. <laughs> Skirt off! Skirt! This little boy wanted me to hoop with him. I don't know where he's at right now, but... Oh my god, there he is! <laughs> Talking about me, bro. 
Oh, me, okay. me and Kenny about a hoop. Yesterday, me and Kenny got pretty heated. He was doing some extreme fouls on me. I almost broke my neck on one of them. I ate about 100 M&Ms for Jidel's video because we got home from the beach. Took like a 15 minute break, 20 minute break, took a nap. I love taking 20 minute naps, like recharging myself. All right, guys, so it's Wednesday. Sorry I haven't been vlogging, I'm back. But, uh, you know, people have been saying like my hair, the giraffe needs a new look. So I got my hair did today. And look what I did to it. Yeah, I look like Coolio right now. <laughs> I look like that doll from Rugrats that barely has any hair, but. So I got some like twists, but this isn't like the final look. I'm leaving it twisted right now. And then like later tonight or maybe even tomorrow, I'm gonna like undo it. And you're probably thinking like, oh, like why don't you just leave it? I mean, this really wasn't how I thought it was gonna look. Cause she said it looks like the lady that braided it. You know, she did a good job, but what I really wanted out of this, like I forgot what it's called. This is the first time too guys that I've ever done anything to my hair other than like let it grow but anyways it's gonna like untwist and then my curls are gonna be super curly so yeah i'm hoping that works if it doesn't oh well my hair will go back to normal yeah or maybe like if you guys comment down below or tweet at me if i should actually like try to get some like braids or something i don't know brie doesn't really fuck with it you know since that's my girl if she don't like it i ain't gonna do it but i i hate like the way it looks right now i'm gonna be honest i'm gonna go about my day i'm about to stream right now but i'm putting a fucking hat on no don't not on the food i already done it by accident what do you mean like it's a little bit poured over there on the fish yeah but on the aluminum foil you're getting that piece Hey man, if I die, I'm gonna die lit. Alright, y'all, so just got done eating a big meal. Oh, had that steak, green beans. I still got the green beans left. Potatoes, sweet potato. Oh man. You guys don't know how good it is right here for you, man. Alright, you guys, just got home. We're having a conversation with James up there. <laughs> What what world records did you break today? One. Which one? Most M and M's eaten while blindfolded using chopsticks in one minute. Who broke that? You? Did you break that? Jesse. Jesse's good with chopsticks like that. He found a very cheese method to just use them as a shovel and just shovel it into his mouth. Peace out, vlog. I'm done vlogging for today. Just whooped Kenward in some basketball. Now it's about 8 o'clock. I'm about to hop on a call with my boy Matthew. He kind of helps me with like the back end of my channel, like analytics and stuff, planning. We've been working together for like a year and a half, but seriously working together uh, like the last month, month and a half. And I've been uploading every every other day since then. So it's been keeping me consistent, getting good ideas flowing. And yeah, I'm about to talk to him for probably like an hour, hour and a half. For the aspiring 2K YouTubers, these are 10 videos I was going to do until I realized how much I didn't like the game uh, so these will probably bang go take them have fun at it all right friends heading to bed sorry I haven't vlogged too much like the last two three days it's just like I've been recording videos during the day and it's like I'm like just focused on that video and not focused on the vlog and I'm like, oh my god I'm vlogging time to head to bed this dude is so entered you gotta every time bro you are <laughs> literally rolls over every time the camera's on and he's a star all right y'all heading to bed see you later oh yeah you guys see it, a little behind the scenes. Basically, I'm about to fire up stream, just a little setup. Yeah, I'm just gonna play some 2K for a couple hours. And then after that, Brie will probably be home. We're gonna hang out. That's been, like guys, this week has been kind of crazy. Um, you guys saw that we traveled, but when I got back, it's really just not a lot going on for me. Like I, I did a lot of like emails and catching up editing and I'm not gonna like show you all that. I can't really show you all the meetings I have either. Cause like, yeah, but you when, I, when you saw that crash, me and Jesse, we were, you know, we were out to some tings, you know, behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying? I feel like every time I vlog in this video, my hair has been a tragedy. But these are not a tragedy. They're not actually on the soles yet. I just kind of threw them inside. Here's the Jordan sole looks like without anything on it. They're going to look pretty sick. But I'm exhausted. And Cookie wants to hang out pretty badly. We didn't get a lot of time together today. So I'm going to hit exit game on today, guys. All right, guys, good morning. It's Thursday. As you can see, I took out my twist this morning. Hair looks a little better. Got a little nappy side over here that I need to take care of. But yeah, I'm going to Starbucks. Today's objective is I'm gonna record. 
not stream, but record some park videos possibly with Zach. And then I think the other guys may or may not need me. Today is super windy in Calabasas. Uh, we saw a tree in our driveway, but yeah, it like fell down from straight wind. So I'm just gonna record park videos. Morning guys, it's uh, Thursday. I'm editing my hydro dipping video. I'm gonna post that later today. Today's the windiest day I think it's ever been in uh, young Cookie's life. <laughs> Oh. He's uh, he's not really thrilled about it. He's kind of confused. I feel bad for the little guy. Man, I love this weather. I really just want to go to like a pumpkin patch with Cookie and just walk around. You want to go pumpkin picking, little guy? Are you interrupting me, young Cook? I'm going to get back to editing. Say bye, Cook. Boys, it is the early morning. I'm here with my boy, Chris Johnson. He's an NBA trainer right now. I didn't even know who was going to be here. Yeah, Iman Shumpert is on the court. You know, practicing, getting some work. And then I'm doing a video with Chris after this. So that should be pretty cool. Yeah, I'm just chilling. It's pretty cool watching NBA players you know, work out. Let's see, it. will Iman get a bunch? Iman Shumpert. Hey. These ain't even my kids. They handed here. me these out the he, trunk. He drove over here. He He's was a up size 13. 13 I'm playing a 15. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Gorilla style today. You feel me? Hey, bro, you got some shoes? I'm trying to hoop. That's all you need. Once you play at you, that's all you need. All right, yo. So. About to take some pre-workout. No, I do not recommend you guys to take pre-workout, especially if you guys are young. You know, I just take pre-workout because it give me that extra boost. <coughs> oh, tastes bad, cuz I hit the wave. Man, sour. I just got done editing and now I'm just, you know, eating a little meal prep lunch. After this, I'm gonna go pick up a package that got dropped off at UPS. I got the Off-White Hollow's Eve, super excited. Probably pretty much the last shoe that I've really, really wanted. Now, I don't wanna ever say a collection is complete, but I really don't feel any pressure to buy any more shoes after this. So I feel like I'm in a good place. They're so beautiful. This shoe is awesome. Can't wait to put these on. Uh, also really exciting seeing the different ways that they changed it from the original blazer. I don't know if anyone cares, but little things like this decorative stick being turned into like a whole kind of different piece of material. I don't know. They did similar things with the Jordan. To me, it's super cool. Gonna study the shoe, wear the shoe, do a lot of things. Shoe is on the sole, but it's not sewed. Jordans are actually sewed to their soles as well as glued. Watching my Giants play the Patriots game just started. We're probably gonna get killed. Uh, this is the first time I have not felt confident against the Patriots. Tom Brady is probably gonna rip us a new one though. <laughs> my Giants just tied the game at 14-14. And the first one is finished, all stitched up. It's looking pretty good. Yeah, pretty happy with it. I just finished the workout that was like, I haven't worked out in a while, that was one of the hardest workouts I've done. There's so much running, like the repetitions and running, it got me dead. But like right when I walked in the gym, like Iman Shumpert, some other guys were working out with Chris. And after they were done, Chris is like, you're trying to make a video? And they were all like, I'm down. So like on the spot, we did a king of the court and I actually did pretty well. I kept taking out my one legged move and that was fire. And then I did a lot of training with Chris, which was really cool. He's right there talking to Kenny about cameras and all that. I just had a ton of fun, hard work, good sweat. Like that's an amazing start to the day. All right, you guys, it is uh, 4.48 Thursday afternoon. I did a really bad job vlogging today, but I mean, I didn't really do anything. I was just editing my pumpkin video since the morning. That's really it. Right now, I'm going to Ralph's to buy more pumpkins. I already bought like basically all of them. I'm gonna buy, I think like four more because I wanna prank the guys. Like basically the idea is have them paint on pumpkins for like half an hour. Pretend like I'm gonna rate them and judge them, but I'm just gonna like smash them and get their reactions on camera. It's kind of like a prank and a pumpkin customizing thing in the same video, I guess. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. Uh, going to Ralph's now to steal more pumpkins from them. We'll purchase, but they're gonna be out soon. That sucks. My vlogs, my vlog game fell off, man. Dude, for my grown-ups out there, I filed for an extension on taxes, and I've been working on that all freaking day, because that shit is due next week. And being a YouTuber, bro, it's tough. It's rough out here, and that's what I've been working on. I'm sorry. I know the other guys, they probably look like they've been having way more fun, and I'm pretty sure they have. I can assure that. But right now, I'm taking a break, and then the break consists of this. Editing a new Guess Who. I know you guys love them. Swim James Part 2. These are some fat-ass pumpkins. Who's gonna
gonna be the judge. And what the hell is on the floor? Uh, you know, just recycled paper from James Craig. You know, needed to cut. Ah, uh, I see what you did really there. Wasteful. We really do reuse stuff a lot. Yeah, too, exactly. A oh, video there, really Dude, all your fucking try hard. You Google painting no, 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 pumpkins, no, 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 bro, no, 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 before no, 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 Mopey's no, video. No, I never did that. My <laughs> God, Zach, <laughs> you are a try hard, bro. bro. Saw the Joker movie. My overall thoughts, it was a good movie. I recommend it. It's pretty graphic, but I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a bit slow, like the pacing of it, but overall really good. But people are hyping it up like best movie of the year. I saw Chris say that. I wouldn't say that or like best Joker movie of all time. I wouldn't go that far, but it was a good movie. Enjoyed it overall. Had fun watching it. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the week. This is going to be my last clip. I'll see y'all later. Drop a like.